Hey guys, welcome to another Server Miner plugin tutorial. I'm your host, LGDim007, and today we're looking at the Level Tools plugin. This is a really awesome and simple plugin that allows your players to level up their tools just by using them. And doing so, they can get rewards like money, XP, and a shout out in chat or anything else you want. So let's go ahead and show you how it works. If I were to put a pig down and hit it with my sword, this is going to give me $100 and level up my sword to level 1. So if we have a look at the lore, we can see we are 14 out of 100 to get to level 2, so that's obviously 14%, and it also gave us an enchantment. So we got sharpness 1 for that, and if we hit some pigs and squid some more, we can see we are now 42% of the way to get to level 2. Now if I go and use the shovel, you can see the same thing happens. So by default there's only two levels, level 1 and level 2, but I edited the shovel a little bit to add four different levels, so every 50 XP you go up a level, and if we just keep using it we can see what happens when we get to the next level. So level 2 at 50 we are going to get $50 and efficiency 2. If we use the pickaxe the same thing will happen, I haven't touched this so you need 100, and if you have a look the stone is going to give you 1 XP per block you destroy. Obviously you can tweak this and add different blocks. If I give myself some gravel and just place it down and hit it with the shovel, you will see it's going to give me exactly zero XP. The reason for that is in the config you choose which blocks give you XP and which don't. So by default it's only grass and dirt for the shovel that will level it up. Uh, but obviously you could add loads of different blocks to allow your players to level it up in different ways. And there we go, I have reached level 3, so I got $100, it's now efficiency 3 which is pretty good, and it's on its way to level 4 at 150 XP. And obviously you can change these XP values so it's not quite as quick and it's actually a bit harder to um, get these rewards. If you do level tools in chat it will show you the three different plugins that can hook into that. So auto sell, token enchant and crazy enchant. If you use any of those, you can obviously enable it in the config file and they can hook into each other, which is pretty nice. But apart from that, that's pretty much everything in-game. And let's head over to the config and see what we can do in there. So here we are in the SMP control panel and there is a single config.yml. Let's jump into it. So up at the top, you've got the other plugins that I mentioned that you can hook into. They are currently all disabled because I don't have any of them. But if you did, uh, you could change that to true and they could hook into each other. Then if we scroll down we've got all the different tools, so we've got pickaxe, axe, shovel, sword, bow and crossbow. So let's have a look at the pickaxe which is default, so is it enabled? Yes. The law, so it says blocks, level and XP and obviously how much is needed and then which blocks it will use. So currently only stone works for the pickaxe, you could probably add cobblestone and diorite and all netherrack, all of those and they give you 1 XP per stone you destroy. Then you have the level, so by default we've got 1 and 2, so level 1 which is 0 XP needed, so as soon as you touch another block it's going to give you $100, it's going to congratulate you and give you dig speed 1 or efficiency 1. And then the second level just gives you $200 and it requires 100 XP, so 100 stone to get that level. Obviously you'd want to change that, get maybe 10 or 50 levels or something just to make it a bit harder. Axe is going to be exactly the same thing, so instead of stone it's oak log. Probably want to add all the other pieces of wood um, and leaves to this. And then if we go down to shovel, which is the one I actually edited, these are the four levels that I added. So level 2 is 50 XP, level 3 is 100, level 4 is 150. And it's really simple, if you wanted to add another one, you could literally just copy and paste one of the previous ones underneath, like so. Obviously change the number to 5, you could change the XP required as well to maybe 250 and then change the reward as well if you wanted to. So that is everything in the config file. Uh, pretty straightforward, you can customize it, add loads of levels with different rewards for your players to make it actually exciting to go mining. If we have a look at the Spigot page, you can see it's updated from 1.8 to 1.16. These are all the current supported tools, but the developer is wanting to add uh, more potentially in the future. But if you need a server to host it on, check out serverminer.com for the best and cheapest hosting around. But that's it for me. Subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.